Hey Elite Contenders! It is Micah and I'm super pumped for this call today. I've been a little bit fired up today. <laughs> um, that's what happens when I like overdose on personal development. I get like all worked up and motivated and like crazy and so I am busting stuff out today. Tara and I had a Zoom this morning and we're just a little pumped up, okay? So I'm super stoked for this call and this topic. Um, and I just want to dig right in. I don't want to keep, I don't want to make this long because it doesn't need to be. It's really simple. Um, and I know that everyone has calls and trainings and all of these things pulling at your time. And so I want this just to be focused and to the point. So first of all, I want you guys to get clear. This biz, or this call is called Screw the Business, Rock Your Life. And I 100% believe that everything that this business like tells you to do, everything that we're supposed to do every single day, who it doesn't matter if I was working the business or not, it makes my life better, okay? So I think some people get really jaded by business activities and by the stress of showing up to work your business. But hello, showing up to do those activities are making your life better. Okay, what does that entail? Let's break it down, okay? We have to do PD, we have to do personal development. Dang it, we have to grow, we have to become better, we have to overcome fears, we have to be more confident, we have to have self-love, we have to learn how to talk to people, we have to, um, learn how to be a leader so that we can help more people. Dang it, that sucks, right? Come on. What else do we have to do? We have to work out. You can't be a health and fitness coach if you're not working out, okay? You have to work out and you have to be healthier. You have to be focusing on being as healthy as you can and just feeling good, fueling your body right with the right foods, with a shake that is freaking awesome. Um, dang it, that sucks, right? What's another thing we have to do? Oh, we have to care about people. We have to invest in others to build relationships and to connect and to help them. We have to get outside ourselves, stop being selfish for five seconds and help other people, care about them, care about what's going on in their life, care about what tools you have and the value that you can add to their life. Dang it, that sucks again. And, and the fourth thing we have to do every single day we have to praise people and recognize them and help give them love and empower them and, and encourage them and show them that we appreciate them and we're proud of them. You guys, let's get real for five seconds. Those are the four vital behaviors that we have to do every single day. This business is basic. It is simple. It is so simple. Stop overcomplicating it and stop getting in your own way. You guys, if you personal development is not your number one focus for the rest of your life, you're doing yourself a disservice. That is what this business is all about. You have to grow, you have to develop, you have to learn, you have to overcome, you have to become. And how blessed we are that that is our sole focus, our first and foremost thing that we need to do is grow and develop and become. So when you feel like I'm struggling, I'm down, I need to take a step back. I want you to check yourself. Do you need to take a step back from the business or do you need to lean in to the business? Do you need to lean into these activities that are going to help you? Do you need to lean into your journey? Do you need to lean into the support and the community and the, the coach page and all of those things that are going to help you dust yourself off Get out of the funk that you put yourself in. It's not because of the business that you put yourself in this funk. It's most likely everything else that's going on around you that you're letting take over your life. The business is easy to let go of, but I can promise you that the activities that we do as a coach are the things that are going to help you in every aspect of your life. Coaching is seriously like the gateway to growing and developing and becoming and everything, your goals, be healthier, be more financially set, be 
physically and mentally stronger, be a bigger influence and have a bigger impact on the world. You guys, seriously, does this make sense? Like, it, it fires me up when I get a message that's like, I need to take a step back. I'm like, from what? From becoming a better person? From, from being healthy? From caring about people? You need to take a step back from this? No, you probably need to take a step back from all the other crap in your life that's bringing you down, that's surrounding you with negativity, that's filling up your time and not moving you closer to any of your goals, okay? So I, if you ever have that thought cross into your brain, like, I need to take a step back, or I'm struggling. Like, what are you struggling with? Cut the crap, focus on the four vitals, and get back to what this business is. This business is about becoming, I've said this five million times, becoming, growing, helping, loving, inspiring, being that person that can help someone, whether they order crap from you or not, be there for people. And that can only happen when you're present on social media and you're present in people's lives because they aren't gonna know to come to you. I did this video this morning on how to get past your excuses. I went live because it was just something that came, that was on my heart from something that happened this morning. And I've already received multiple messages, just like, dude, this is exactly what I needed to hear. Thank you so much. Do I care if they ever order anything? No, because guess what? I help them in whatever moment they're struggling with right now that helped them. And that fulfills me. So how can you add value today? How can you live your best life every single day? And if you weave in the business activities, and if you do the intentional activities that it's gonna take, send your invites, run a challenge group, have an environment where you can actually help the people who need help. Those are the basics. So don't overcomplicate it. They go hand in hand. If you want a better life, then do better at the business because they aren't separate. They are so entwined or intertwined or whatever that word is, intertwined. So just, just keep it simple, you guys. This is all I'm going to say is be intentional. They go hand in hand. Don't separate the two. If you want to be better, if you want to be healthier, if you want to be more financially free, if you want to help more people, if you want to do all of these things that we all want to do and why we're here, then be freaking consistent with the basics. Do your four vitals. Don't slack off on those things. Those are things that have to be a priority. Whether you want to be successful as a coach in the business or whether you just want to be better at life, make those things a priority because they will bless your life, okay? That's all I got. Keeping it quick. Keeping it real. I love you guys. Seriously. I love you guys. And I love this group. And I love the focus and intention. So stay focused through the holidays. Help more people. And do the freaking things that it's going to take to change some lives. Starting with you. Okay? Get real here. Start here. And everything else benefits from there. <sighs> All right. Bye, guys.